at a car show this weekend, I watched a guy pull in and set his car up for display, and he was sitting in the front seat arranging the fuzzy dice to get that picturesque look because driving in caused them to swing and sway, and they hung one over top of the other. I'll show you a little trick. Here's an excerpt from several different sites on the internet. The use of fuzzy dice is believed to be traced back to American fighter pilots during World War II. Pilots would hang the dice above their instruments, displaying seven pips before a sortie mission for good luck. Knowing the original use of dice, Mark Shepard Jr., a former CEO of Texas Instruments, created the first fuzzy dice in 1952 when he was a project engineer. He supposedly made them as a good luck gag gift for a professional acquaintance. In the 1950s, the fuzzy dice became one of the first items sold specifically to be suspended from the mirror. Ed Sundberg and Lupe Zavala claimed to have started the trend in 1959 at Decofelt Corporation in Glendora, California. When the dice were produced in other countries, designers adopted a fuzzy plush material. You want them to always hang in that picturesque look no matter how they swing and sway. Just take a sewing needle, poke a hole in the corner, poke a hole there, and just plug the two together. They'll stay that way forever. <laughs>